everybody, my name is Dawn. Today, this is episode 3 of Climatic Survival. So, where are we at? Oh god, lag spike. That was out of the blue. Let me change that. I don't even know why we have it on far, to be honest. And my computer's been terrible lately with the lag. But, you know, some things you've just got to deal with in this world. You know, seriously, something wrong with that. Hmm. Wait, that's not, that's not render distance. Hmm. Odd. Anyway, so in today's video, I've decided that I'm going to talk about things I absolutely hate. Like, I'm not talking this usual hate where people are like, oh, I hate you. I'm talking hate where I'm willing to whip out the biggest knife in the kitchen and slice them bit by bit, cook them, and then sell them to Tesco. That's what I'm talking about. Right, I'm just going to start this off, this topic off, with quite a general one, and that is lack of common sense. I mean, it's called common sense for a reason. They didn't name it very uncommon sense, because I'm pretty sure I'm one of the only people in the world with it. Like, everyone is just so bad at life. I'm just there, like... My teacher will ask a question, and I'm like, oh, this is an easy one. You know, common sense, it says it on the board. The answer is on the board, like directly in front of you, and the absolute spacker of a person will get it wrong. And I'm there, and I'm I'm on the floor, I'm dead. I, I'm, I'm slitting my wrists. It's just out of all, I can't believe people are so bad at life. It just, oh. And another thing is like, when you get on the bus and you don't have your money ready, like, why do you have your money ready? It's like, oh, you got on the bus, you know you're getting on the bus. Ah, you... <laughs> uh, just get your money ready. If you got your money ready, you don't have to sit there for five minutes while they were watching you getting your money ready because you. <laughs> and then you claim that you don't have enough money, so you have to. And the bus driver has to let you off for like two quid, and you're just like, oh, I'm sorry, I've got to count my money. Well, maybe if you got your money out before you got on the bus, you realise that you needed an extra ten p. Oh. Ah. Right. Now this next one. This one doesn't just pain me. Right. This next one is. I think it's one of the worst. And that's crisps. No, 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 not any, not any crisps. I'm talking about people dropping crisps now now that sounds odd doesn't it people dropping crisps what but seriously i've never dropped a crisps in my life i've never dropped a crisp but all of a sudden 15 people will drop crisps like who drops a crisp you've got it in your hand oh that was a nice noise you've got it in your hand how do you drop it how how does it ah how does it just release from your hand it was in your hand it was completely secure and now it's on the floor that rhymed whoa but seriously i was i was there with a good friend of mine in skype it's late at night and i'm tired and she's eating crisps right so i'm like oh she's eating crisps i watch and uh and she drops yeah, yeah you heard me right she drops a crisp Oh, I was so tired. I was even raging, being tired. Inside, I was dying. Every single bit of my ginger soul was just being burned. It was like... <laughs> Seriously. I never looked at her the same way again. She dropped crisps, man. It's just... It's just... It's the worst. I've never dropped a crisp. The day I drop a crisp, I will go around apologising. But today, to this day, I have never dropped a crisp. So the next one is, eh, I suppose quite a lot of people don't like them, but burps. I mean, farts are alright, to be honest. I mean, you fart, and eh, it smells a bit bad. Ooh, 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 everybody moves out the way. Oh, you farted, ha ha, funny. But burps, no, bur burps are different. You see, burps can happen anywhere anywhere so you've just eaten an ice cream and you burp right and i'm there and i'm cr i'm on the floor i hate burps the smell of them it just gets into your stomach it's like you've just swallowed their absolute food from the last five days it's like 
I'm there swallowing these burps, and I'm, I'm pretending not to act like I absolutely hate them. I'm like, oh, this is just a, it's just a burp. It's just a burp, Dylan. It's just a burp. It's not anything else. It's just a burp. It's just a burp. And while I'm there, crying inside, absolute fiery hell is just burning up inside my heart as they burped. And I mean, you can have a silent but deadly fart, but who has a silent but deadly burp? I mean, no one. The sound of it, it just makes me sick. It's like, did you, did you just actually make that noise? I did, what? I'm pretty, that, that ain't human. I'm pretty, pretty sure. What? What? It's just, it's, oh, I hate burps. If anyone ever, and I mean ever, burps in my face, I mean, I'm going to have to start slicing and dicing. Because, seriously, burps are just out of the way. Disgusting. Ah, so, um, they're pretty much most of the things I hate. Apart from, like, vision, which everybody, ooh, that's a nice hole, which everyone hates. Yeah. So, um, you might, I might sound a bit different, like slightly different, not too much, and that's because I actually got my fixed brace installed last Friday? What day is it today? Um, I don't even know. Last Friday I got my brace installed, um, yeah, sort of fell asleep. They were just casually putting this brace on and it was like, and they were like, open your mouth, but like, they were always like complaining about how oh, my mouth wasn't open enough, so they put this little thing in my mouth, and my mouth was just open, and I didn't feel like I needed to participate in this ceremony anymore, so I just fell asleep. And yeah, they put my brace on. Woke up, they were like, what, what colour do you want it? And I was like, you know what, I think I'm liking a bit of this baby blue today. And they were like, alright then, guess we're having baby blue. Which, to be honest, I think I might get a dark blue neck time to match my eyes. I, um, uh, yeah, you can see my eyes one day. They're blue. Um, but it's a nice blue and yeah first day you're like you've got your fixed brace it's all on your mouth you're like oh it's quite nice actually doesn't hurt too much about an hour in all oh, oh, oh yeah, mm, mm, yeah and then and then you wake up the next day right oh you're just expecting to wake up to a normal relaxing Saturday morning but no but no it's not any Saturday morning. It's Saturday morning where your teeth are killing. That that absolutely there is no ache like that. Sorry about that. There is no ache like that. It's like I mean, I had a twin block, which is basically a retainer before it, and I mean that ached a bit, and I was like, oh, this aches. But that that was a new ache. I don't think that ache's been invented yet. That's how new it was. It was blooming. Oh, and and my gums swelled up. Sorry about the details, but it has to be done. And yeah, it's, it's, uh, it's not nice. You don't want a fixed brace. Well, you probably do if you have wonky teeth, because if you don't, then you're gonna be wonky, aren't you? But eh, the pain's a bit bad. But I guess you're all hard men and women. So yeah, you won't feel the pain. Oh, she. Can you hear that? What the? What is that? Since, what? Since when did they add blue tits to Minecraft? What the? No, seriously. I hear slimes as well. What is that? That ain't normal. What the? That is odd. We're investigating. Oh my! I didn't. How did I not notice that before? Pretty sure that was grown as well. Derp. But oh well. All right. Have we got anything to cook? No, we have not. Actually, oh, let's cook raw chicken. Cook you up a bit. All right, we need to go and search iron to be honest, because we need a pickaxe, which is better than stone. Because one of the challenges was to get diamond. So, I think what we'll do is we'll find some iron, and then we'll end the episode here. Oh man, in the windows. They're not even windows. I can see the floor coming here soon, actually. So I'm going to have to watch my, watch my back. I'll make sure there's a stairway down as well, because you don't want to have to make one. 
which is completely irrelevant because we'd make one anyway. It's just slightly saving, not a lot of time, and it's just one of them things you do. Right, right that is really an... Oh, you see, I'm, I've got telekinesis. See, I was about to say, that's really, but you know, they're already... Wait, what? These aren't normal. When were these added to Minecraft? Move out the way. Move out the way. Thanks. I do not remember this update. Ow. Yeah, you die. You die. You... How do you kill him? Well, they've escaped. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> oh, I feel well mean now. I just killed a bat. What's, what's it ever done to me? Oh, well. Yeah. No, I need to stop killing him. It's really mean. Mm, it's climbing in your window. Whoa, this spire goes on quite far. So that's going to go through the floor, isn't it? No, it's not. Oh, brilliant. It's quite a nice shaped map, to be honest. I know it probably you probably really don't care what shape it is, but I'm quite an architectural person. Shape really matters for me. <laughs> that's what she said. Bid it. Now, imagine if she did, though. It was like octagon penis. <laughs> I like your octo penis. Die. Right, I'm, I'm gonna go up, cook this iron. Iron? Iron. Iron. I'm gonna go cook this iron. And then, at the end of the episode, um, it'll be all good, me lad. Oh, didn't know this was gravel there. Lag. Wait, so I've actually only explored halfway down. So you can go down quite a lot more, which I didn't realise. So, I guess we'll... Oh. God. Bloody hell. This is claustrophobic. Alright, cook this, iron, and then I'll make a pickaxe, and then we'll end it there. And I'm gonna go design a house on a piece of paper with a pencil and a ruler. I never use pencils, except for now, because I'm using a pencil, which is quite rare. It looks so much sexier in a pencil though. I used a pen once and it was just like, I couldn't rub it out when I did a wall wrong, because what I was doing I was doing some little bit of architecture. This sounds really posh, but it wasn't. It wasn't anything special. It was just I didn't even look up how to draw architecture. I just sort of guessed and yeah, put measurements in. So I did that, and it looked pretty sexy. Except for when I did this whole wall wrong, and it just looked like there was something sticking out the house. It completely ruined it. Not a good idea. Anyway, so we have our pickaxe. I'll make a sword, and then we'll end it. Wait, do we need to make a? Do we really need to make a sword? No, we'll make a shovel then. Right, thanks for watching guys. Have a nice day.